believe it or not, making refried beans from scratch is a lot easier than it sounds, and especially if you have an instant pot. Just soak the beans overnight in cold water in the fridge, and then the next day when you're ready to cook them, bring them out of the fridge and drain them. Put them in your instant pot, put in some chicken or beef bouillon or broth. I add cilantro, chili powder, onions, cumin. Sometimes I put in garlic and I put in jalapenos. This is another one where you can really just use whatever you feel like using. Make sure that you don't fill your water any more than to the fill line. Let me know in the comments if you would like a video on how to use the Instant Pot or specific things about the Instant Pot like how to get the lid to shut so that it seals properly. And always make sure your vent is closed. I usually set my Instant Pot on about an hour for the beans because you never know how old your beans are. So I figure the more the better. You wanna get out as much of the liquid as you can and then use an immersion blender to blend it up as smooth as you can. And you've gotta be patient with it because it does take a minute. Make sure that you don't throw that broth out yet because you might still need it because if you have really older beans, then they tend to be a lot more dry and suck up a lot of moisture. But that's it, it's so easy. And it tastes so much better. It's great for all sorts of things, to eat it cold as just regular old bean dip, or you can eat it hot as a bean dip. You can make seven layer dip with it. You can make burritos, whatever. It just works great and it tastes so much better and it's way cheaper. Homemade refried beans are one of our favorite things to make. And thank you so much for watching. Make sure that you like, subscribe, share, and comment. And if you wanna see my guacamole video, you can either click the link in this video or go to my page and see it.